What's new? What? Uh, wait, what the fuck? The House overwhelmingly voted for the Space Force to be passed with over $700 billion funded towards it. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, God! So, yeah, you remember when Trump was talking about, you know, initiating a space force as a new branch of the military? Apparently, he wasn't fucking kidding. For some reason, both Democrats and Republicans wanted this voted in. So, both sides wanted this. Both sides wanted something that Trump proposed. First of all, that never fucking happens. Second of all, why? Third of all, $700 billion, holy shit. Oh my god, it's almost four times the budget of the fucking military itself. That's a lot of money, guys. Holy crap. But why? Why? There's so much shit around Trump. Why would the Democrats actually agree with him and <laughs> help him with his space empire? <laughs> he's gonna be fucking Palpatine. He's just gonna be like, uh, dude, fucking small loan of a million dollars. Luke, Luke, take the money. Take the money, Luke. Wait, no, you can't have the money. You're from, you're from over the border. You're not allowed in here. He starts deporting people to space and he's like, unlimited power. Yes, yes, it's great. It's great. I have unlimited power. Get across the border into space. Yes. This article is from a website called The Hill. It says, when Trump first proposed the Space Force as the sixth branch of the United States military in June 2018. Basically, everyone thought it was a joke and thought he was being retarded. My myself included. I thought that was just complete bullshit. <laughs> it's not anymore. As I said earlier, the House authorized its establishment as a part of the Defense Authorization Bill. Remarkably, a considerable number of Democrats voted for the bill that contained the Space Force. They did so in return for provisions that allowed a 12-week family leave for federal workers. Thus, a spacefaring, war-fighting military service was born. Oh my fucking god. So, like, in all honesty, my guess is they're, they're, they, because of the lack of space push in the last few years since the lunar missions, yeah, there's been a lot of advancements, but it hasn't been as gradual or as much as it should have been. But they're gonna be starting from, like, not that far. I mean, they got a shitload of money so they can make whatever they want. They're probably gonna start with making ships and stations and fucking maybe a colony on the moon. I don't fucking know how they're gonna do it. I don't know. I'm not that smart, but <laughs> they'll figure it out. They got a bunch of the Air Force and they got $700 billion in their pocket. They're gonna figure it out. The funny thing is, though, from what we know, no other country is doing something like this. It's kind of bizarre. What what, what the fuck are we gonna do? Just have, like, an American military presence just sitting on the moon, driving around, two dudes standing on a space station just going, yep. Now, of course, military presence in space is inevitable, but I honestly didn't expect it to be this soon. I would have expected it in like 20, maybe 30 years. It looks like it's happening now. It's not that big a deal. It's against the Geneva Convention, I think, to even have missiles in space, so they're already limited on what they can put up there. I mean, even if they have bullets up there, what the hell are they gonna do? Just rain fire down on cities? I mean, they could do that. It'd kind of suck. But they could do that, you know, if the bullets don't burn up in the middle of the atmosphere. Also, real quick before this video ends, um, uh, I want to give a quick little shout out to two people in my Discord server. They both asked to stay anonymous or whatever, but they uh, boosted the server to Weiss, which was pretty chill. And uh, yeah, I'll be doing more videos soon. Right now, I'm sick. I don't know if you can hear it. Um, this, the third of the audio recorded in this video was me being sick. Um, so, yeah, more videos will be coming. It's, uh, maybe one on, uh, Anime Midwest, because that's where I'm going this coming week. Or actually, this weekend, I'm going with, uh, Daring Discord, Jojo Violet, and a few other people. So, I might do something on that, I don't know. Yeet. Yeah.